So uh, this week we are vlogging from the amazing North Devon. We've come down uh, in the van. We've bought most of the toys. We've maybe done some bit controversial. We haven't bought the bikes. Um, so we're kind of mainly on foot and in the water this week. Um, well, you can see behind me probably, hopefully, we've got the tall estuary. Um, and it's kind of Barnstables down there. And then you've got kind of all the surf beaches out this way. Um, sort of just kind of in the direction I'm pointing up the coast there. Um, and you've got the lovely Tarka Trail that comes all the way down along the tour and then it kind of continues up around the coast and becomes the southwest coastal path. So hoping to uh, get out and explore some of the uh, Tarka Trail, some of the southwest coastal path hopefully as well. I'll give you a few little kind of route ideas if you're coming down yourself for a holiday or a break. Um, and then you know further afield you've got Dartmoor you can see over there as well. Um, so there's just absolutely tons of tons of choices around here. You will not run out of things to do and Amazingly, we've also got the weather for it as well. So it's kind of nice, 20 degrees, gentle breeze. So it's absolutely perfect for running around and stuff. Right, we're going on a bear hunt. I'm going down, looking for Park Trail and the Southwest Coastal Park. And we're watching out the cow pack. And trying to not get our clean train as muddy because we didn't think it was going to be muddy. So we haven't got our scruffy old ones on. Pretty good for you though. <laughs> what do you mean? We're bound to have to run back up there. So the, it's somewhere down there by the river in the background. Because it's North Devon, every hill is steep. Down there. Look. Yeah, I reckon this is about one in three. <laughs> Top of the hill is about 170 meters, I think. So we've obviously got to go down to sea level ish. Oh, stingers out! Brambles, stingers. Oh. It's proper country stuff. <laughs> this is a ridiculously steep hill. Oh my god. I reckon it's. Is it possible for a gradient to be like 50%? I think this is skiable <laughs> for sure. <laughs> Look at my feet, I'm doing a little like baby steps. I'm doing my anti-run. <laughs> a shuffle. Downhill shuffle. Oh my god. <laughs> Any grip on this train at all. Wet feet, oh no. Another little kissing gate. And big steps. And the farm. Lovely. That was Blakewell Farm. Very steep sided hills, aren't they? These, I love these signs. <laughs> the old Devon ship. So we'll just come down that big hill. We're looking for our footpath seems to suggest straight through this field <laughs> watching out for the lambs oh, it's actually so, over the over the stile or through the fence <laughs> oh, poor sheep. sheep run oh it's quite ripe isn't it <laughs> There's that little parcel-y thing on the hill. Ah! We're not going over there, are we? I don't think so. There's all these strange small castles. <laughs> that one's literally just a gateway, isn't it? Somebody's house. You can see in the background there's the estuary. And hopefully down there, that's where the Tarka Trail is. Um, the only tricky thing is going to be making it back up the hill. It's a slight navigational challenge because the footpaths look like fields and the fields look like footpaths. 
Oh, there's lots of dungy flies. Whoop! <laughs> Somewhere across this field to where we're going. Right there. <laughs> A lovely little bit of sheep poo on your ankle. So, somewhere over yonder. Over there. Yeah. The map oh. says the direction is straight across the field. <coughs> Look out for another signpost. Sheep jog quicker than me. <laughs> sheep jog a lot quicker than me. That's their jog. Or we let that sprint. Oh, this is exciting. A little wooded tunnel on these little footpaths that sort of is squeezed down the back of somebody's back garden. That. It might be straight through that field. Pardon? Yeah. So I'm looking at this cornfield, not seeing a big footpath, but according to this, it's down there and a hanger left at the end. Lovely! Let's go for some nettles. Oh, not possibly well trodden this footpath. I'm trying to jump over the nettles. This is quite funny, isn't it? I'm guessing not massively used by the trail running community. Petrable. Um, you can see it's sort of waist high brambles. Ow. <laughs> Still, there's plenty of dock leaves in case we do sting ourselves. But theoretically, this is the public footpath. Oh, rabbit. Rabbit, 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 rabbit. But it's at least over that hedge and then beyond. Well, it's marked as a public footpath. Be, though, I, mean... I agree it's not looking like a public footpath. I found it, but it is like a nettle fest. I think basically we'll just get stung all the way through. Because it's either side is just up to your waist in stingers. Iris! Thwarted by stinging nettles. But we've admitted defeat, we're running down the road in search of the Tarka Trail. I have a feeling we might not be far away. I can see water. So we found it. The Tarka Trail. It's not nice for us to cycle ride, isn't it? Yeah. Anybody got a bike? <laughs> Running in absolutely ages. That's because you haven't running at me. Oh, <laughs> <terrible. laughs> it's running on that sort of knobbly grassy hills, isn't it? There's all kinds of interesting looking birds down there that we're not going to be able to see because they're too far away. Oh, look, it's all like curly type looking things. Little big, eagles. big. No, no, they've got big curly beaks. Yeah. Curl down. Tricky to eat if they're curled up, wouldn't it? Well, there isn't that one with a curly up beak and one with a curly down beak. Oh, you won't be able to see them on the GoPro, but there's curlews. It's a really nice spot. You can hear them, it's like. Oh, that noise. Is that the curly noise? It's cold, isn't it? This is the curly Is it the curly noise? Baby oyster catchers. Oh, oyster catchers. <laughs> oyster catchers. I must mean there's oysters. It's a shame we haven't got a really big lens to be able to see them. But scuttling along the edge, you can kind of just about see them, maybe. 
I might be able to crop in the GoPro afterwards and we might be able to see it flying off. Morning. Morning. Nice. What goes down must go up. So that's our Tarka Trail down. I think we might just do a drive down to the Tarka Trail next time. Avoid the hill back up. So uh, we're just tracking our way up a little lane. Hopefully it'll take us to the top of a sort of ridge. It'll give us a slightly lower incline back to the start but we've still got probably 5k or so along the top maybe maybe less <laughs> that's a great view pretty high up you see all the way down the tour like towards Barnstable you see like a little bridge in the background That's what Joe thinks of the hill. <laughs> well, our last hill back to the cottage. I think we can safely say we don't have Devon running legs. Our flat Oxfordshire legs we need a bit more training. Final sprint for the sign and cooked breakfast. Here we are. There is the cottage. Ah, uh, we should have taken the horse. Round again then? <laughs> 